In this tutorial we are going to discover the best tool in Photoshop to outline figure is the pen tool. Uh, we have to be sure to see properly the image so zoom in and then with the hand tool scroll the image in order to be uh, sure to have a lot of space to outline. Then select the pen tool and set it on the option bar on the top there are two icons uh, we select the second one, not the first one. The first one is for uh, create shapes layer, the second one is for path. We select the second one and start click and drag. As you can see there is a rubber band because there is this option, this rubber band uh, that is activated probably in your default Photoshop is not activated. So if it's not activated you won't be able to see a preview of the path like this. But if you activate the rubber band is possible. I suggest to use it. Uh, well, now click, drag and drop to place the anchor point and the uh, direction handle and zoom in, zoom out with Ctrl plus and once you place the point, don't care if it is wrong, just Ctrl click on the point and drag it in another place if it was not placed properly. So the trick is to place a uh, less points are as possible and one before the curve and one after the curve and be sure that the rubber band show you uh, that uh, the path is a little bit inside the figure not uh, on the on the edge because once we will create a new layer for, for the for the shape uh, if we are too much on the verge on the border of the picture you, we will see the background in the in the layer so in this curvy area uh, put less points and possible and in the hair just stay a lot inside very far from the edge because we are going to take it out with the filter extract later so keep continue to do this click drag and drop for each point and one point before the curve and one point after the curve. Click drag and drop for each point and ensure to have smooth uh, curves. Uh, this is the opposite of the lasso tool because lasso pol the polygonal lasso tool need uh, a lot of points to make round uh, curves. In for the pen tool is the opposite. The less points the most rounded uh, curve. So we are at the end. To close the path just click on the first anchor point and now we have to convert this uh, path, this vector path in a selection. To do this control click on the image and uh, choose make selection. Uh, in this case uh, we set one pixel of radius and means that the vector will be converted in a selection but not so uh, sharpen but with one pixel of blur. Now Ctrl J or layer new new layer via copy to create uh, a new layer containing the picture and uh, separate uh, the hair uh, just making a squared selection on the background and again Ctrl J or uh, layer new new layer via copy. So we have a portion of the hair on a new layer in the middle between the outline figure and the background. Now we go to choose the filter extract in order to extract the hair and we have the new window for the filter. Just zoom in with the magnify lens like this and select the marker pen and set up the diameter of the brush tip and then start painting on the hair, on the borders of the hair like this, uh, close the track at the end, like this so take the bucket, the second icon on the left and click in the middle of the track and click OK now it's finished, as you can see we have the hair on a separate layer just join together with the other figure we outlined before just selecting both of them together go to the menu layer and merge layers or control E that's finished